you think the 10th episode of Weebles is realistic or impossible? That will be even more exciting. You'll also like this one. What's up folks, how do you do? My name is Guster Lappin speaking to you at your service. This is the 20th episode of the series where we get to determine if they are realistic or impossible. In this episode, I will be reacting to Mac and Cheese, Please, Beans and Frank's Thanks, which is the 10th episode of The Weebles Show. And we will identify if this episode is actually realistic or impossible. Now, as the name implies, this episode is where these Weeble characters have a feast at the barn dance. And this episode introduces a new character named Chumps Legator. He likes to eat mac and cheese as he eats it all up. And we must say please or thank you or other magic words. And I know that I can really tell when I can watch something like these episodes if it is real or if it's fake. But of course, since the episode is animated, everybody knows that it's fake. In that case, we're going to break down the episode and find out if this episode can actually be realistic. Could we create this episode in real life? How realistic would this be and how exciting is it enough for animation? And this episode is also about saying good words to ask for something to be polite to your guests. And that would make other people very proud of themselves as well. Now before we begin the episode, I want you to leave a comment right down below. Do you think the episode is actually realistic or do you think it's impossible? What will you think of the show? And I really want you to know what you can think. And at the end of the video, we will have a discussion and we will reveal the answer. Now let's begin. But the surprise is right behind that big tree, dear. Which Remember? Tree? It's our surprise guest of honor. Our cousin lives far away from Weaverville in a place called Way Far Away. It's me, Chop Slagator. Pleased to meet ya. Yay! That's his name. So now let's see what will happen if they mm -hmm. eat the mac and cheese. Oh, I hope you're hungry. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. I'm hungry. Oh, yeah, faster. My oh! What's happening? <laughs> he ate it all. <laughs> okay, here's the first thing that I really want to mention. We all know that Chumps really likes macaroni and cheese, which might look pretty whimsical. But when he takes the tablecloth off, the bowls fling upward, and even the mac and cheese and lands onto his mouth. And the bottom of the bowls are higher than the table, and they must be the same height as the table, not above, if anything. And that might be really overdone in a way for another dramatic effect, but in real life, that would not happen here. <clears throat> I think we have a problem, Chomps, dear. I think he has a problem. We do? Well, how can I help, Cousin Diddy? Well, Diddy Chomps, is his cousin? dear, you see, here in Weebleville, when we want something, well, we don't just grab it, no. We say please first, and... Please first. Oh, he ate it out of the fork! Oh. Yo, dear. Pendleton's so scared. He's shaking. But it was a good thing that he didn't bite his finger. Don't you think? Well, no one is gonna be hungry for long. Yeah, of course Here not. Here you go. More macaroni and cheese. Mm -hmm. Yep, more for him and the other Weebles. Mine. Oh, what happened? All right, here's the next thing. When Chomp slips up the table, the Weeble characters fling up high, and the mac and cheese flings up and gets even higher again, which is kind of whimsical. But you know, it's very showy and it looks good enough for animation. And then it just lands perfectly right inside his mouth. Boy, oh boy, there must have been so much testing involved to just make it happen. At least in real life. But then it gets flinged into the perfect spot he had again. Grabbing all the food and gobbling it up before anyone else has had a chance to even have any, well, it isn't very nice. I know that. Uh, I guess we do things differently in Way Far Away. Well, I didn't mean not to be nice. It's okay. Oh. Don't oh, worry did about he give thing, Chomps everyone. a kiss? I'll be right back. That was funny. You know, Chomps, sometimes it's really hard to remember to say please. So here's what I do to remember. This is what they'll say. Please, 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 please. Saying please is very pleasing, just like mac and cheese. Saying please is very pleasing, just like mac and cheese. That's right. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. and I hear some 
someone say please? Yes. We're out of mac and cheese. Ooh, what? they're out. Would anyone like some yummy beans and franks? Beans yes, and franks? Please. Oh, they'll like this one. I think they'll like it. Let's see how they taste it. Beans and Franks are yummy. I think they liked it. Delicious, Diddy. I love beans and Franks. That's right. Did you know, some folks call them beans and hot dogs. <laughs> wow, you have such a nice laugh, Bumpus. That's very whimsical. <laughs> well, no matter what you call them, they are yummy. Yeah, that's what I said. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thanks. Thanks, you're thanks right. And saying thanks is yummy, frankly, just like beans and franks. <laughs> That's also right. Uh, please? Well, you mean thanks. Uh -oh. I wasn't supposed to say please this time. I know you I? weren't. Well, you see, it's like this, Chomps. When you're asking somebody for something, you say please. That's right, Bumpus. And when somebody gives you something or does something nice for you, like Diddy did for all of us, you say thanks. You're I welcome. Get it. Please first, thanks after. He got it! <laughs> and that's because you must say please when you're asking for something first. And you also must say thank you when somebody gives you something or does something nice for you. And people call it the magic words. And whoever made all the episodes of the show, I will give you a bunch of major props because the animation is very straightforward. And I also love this episode. It's very fun and important to watch. It makes people very exciting around. And this is more fun. So is the 10th Weebles episode realistic or impossible? Well, it's kind of both. Because what you saw in the episode, the beans and franks parts were fine, but the table spring and the mac and cheese landing on your mouth is not possible this time. So the rating for this episode is 30% realistic and it's 70% impossible. And one amazing thing about the 10th Weebles episode is that it was also seen in the Sharing in the Fun DVD, and it is the last one of its kind. In fact, this is the last proved episode of the Weebles show. But our trip to Weebleville isn't finished yet, because there is a bunch of other episodes waiting to be discovered. And making comic books might make this better for us, don't you think? So tell me what you think about the Weebles show, and tell me what your favorite character is, and tell me what your favorite part of the episode is after watching it numerous times and many times in a row. Removing the tablecloth, flinging the Weebles up high, or eating beans and franks. Well, they're not sure if they make sense, or they don't make sense. So maybe we'll be the lucky ones to find out once and for all. Could we? And one more thing for the finishing touch. We will now watch the Weeble characters give us a round of applause where Chomps says one more special word as they enter the barn dance. And that's the end of the first set. And be on the lookout for more episodes in the next set in 2025. And I hope you all had fun in the video. Please head on over there to see some exclusive stuff that you can't find on YouTube. You can also check out projects we'd like to do in the future. And if you sign up, they'll even take your suggestions far more seriously than the ones you'll find here. So, please comment favorite, and like, and subscribe. And this is Gustav Lappin, coming at you at the 12. <laughs> Goodbye. So long till next time, until 2025. what we way far away weebles say when we make a mistake. It's good manners. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I'm going to please. a barn dance. Wahoo! Please and thanks, excuse, excuse me, me too. Excuse me, That's excuse having me, good manners. Just I like we weebles do. Excuse me, excuse me.